Arthur. You going fishing? Yes. Or running off to Como Driscoll? Of course not. <laughs> I was joking. <laughs> That's very funny. <laughs> yes, that's very funny. I saved your life, and now you torture me. Ho, ho. Shut up. Do you want to go fishing with me? I, I found an interesting spot. We'll do well. I'm not a great fisherman. But I am. <laughs> I'll teach you something. We come? Sure. All right, then. Grab your horse and let's go. Okay, follow me. I know a great little fishing spot along the beach. Who'd have thought it? Wasn't that long ago I was tied to the back of your horse while begging for mercy. Now we're off fishing together. Uh, how do you know I ain't just looking for a good place to drown you? Because, because I saved your life, Arthur. Uh, you keep saying that, but I save your life every day I don't kill you. So we are more than even on that front. Come on, you don't mean that. You better believe I mean it. Now where's this spot? Uh, not much further. This is the place. Some beautiful smallmouth here. Bass? Sure. This strip of shore looks perfect. Pick a spot. Seeing lots of bluegill and bass over here. Bait with worms or crickets. You got them. Otherwise, maybe some bread or cheese? Uh, it's a little close, ain't it, Arthur? You get many bites there, old Driscoll? I ain't an old Driscoll. I told you fellas a hundred times. I'd only been with them a couple of months. I was just a runner, helping out with the horses mainly. Bottom rung of the ladder. And to think that was the high point of your career. Comb goes through men like cigars. They ain't like you folks. You barely knew my name. I'm more Kieran Vanderlyn than Kieran O'Driscoll at this point. Honest to God. Mostly I'm... I'm Kieran Duffy. I hate to break it to you, but I ain't sure Kieran Vanderlyn is gonna stick. Not too fast, you could break the line. Keep it coming, but carefully. Nice. Good catch, Arthur. Now see if you can hook enough. What in the world? Arthur, are you seeing this? The feather's naked as a jaybird. Is that why you like this spot? Hey, watch the line! Oh, There's somebody hey, who needs to go to confession. I never got down a minnow. Sorry, fellas. Didn't see you there. 
Why don't you take a break? Come on in. The water's wonderful. You here for some fishing? Yes, sir. Nothing more relaxing than some time by the water. Sets anything right. So, you just out fishing? We hope to. You haven't scared them all away, have you? Oh, just so you fellas know, there's some real big ones over that way, like this. Well, I better keep the blood pumping. Hope you gents catch something. Yeah? Maybe we'll take a look. Thanks. I know where that is. Well, come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Hey, wait up. Are you coming then? I think this is the place that naked feller was talking about. Did you see that amazing bluegill? Sure. That got you real excited, huh? Come on, Arthur. Let's walk down to the beach. Hope we land this monster. Uh-huh. It ain't easy to catch a fish like that with bread and cheese, but uh, you never know. We might get lucky. Guess we'll see. Get after that bluegill, Arthur. So who taught you how to fish? My pappy, mostly. I, I lost my mammy and pappy when I was young to cholera. Your mammy? Like I said, I was real young. After that, I was on my own pretty much, but I knew horses and fishing. Well, uh, just think now, you'll never be alone again. Did you hook him, the big one? I don't know. Uh, don't feel like much of a fighter. Not bad, but uh, it ain't the one we saw jump out of the water. You got the big one there. Not sure, but he feels big. No, that's not it. I don't think we have much chance. We need better bait. 
You might want to see if the stores around here sell anything better. I think I'm going to head back to Camp Arthur, if that's okay. Sure. Go on, I'll see you later. 